Yeah. There's this bloke, you know, I think it's John Addison or something Addison. Uh, it looks like he, you know, he's just had his first um, dose of chemotherapy or something and he's, you know, they, I don't know, people are taking advantage of him, bringing him up, you know, you know, you're not going to be alive long, can we come up and see your collection sort of thing? We've never been here before, or maybe he's never let them there before, I don't know. But they made a good video of it, I suppose, and lots of bells, sorry, excuse me, lots of bells and whistles on the video, so that was a good thing, but, you know, <laughs> uh, they, made, they made, you know, some fun things at the front, you know, just, it was gas bagging about bloody jeans and they wanted to just see the plants sort or of thing, the usual thing, you know. <laughs> I think that's a trick that the, the, the old timers do, you know. They sit you there just to see how patient you're going to be. They talk a lot of crap and rubbish, you know, sort of thing. And just see how frustrated, just to get you frustrated. Then they show you this grand collection and you almost wet your pants sort of thing, you know. Uh, but uh, yeah, some of these old times, you know, in, in my day, in, in my day, I yeah, know, <laughs> we were given all the, you know, we were given the, the, the peat and sand spiel sort of thing, and we found out later on these, like the old times, the old buggers, they were um, basically going out and digging plants out of the wild and using wild soil. And whenever I've been at someone's place where, you know, had one time where someone sent someone, uh, you know, Bernard in a big lump of soil from the south, you know, the southeast sort of thing, and uh, this this thing grew into a massive plant. You know, it was sitting on the bench, and it went right almost up to the ceiling of the of the greenhouse. It totally occupied, you know, dominated the bloody greenhouse space. You walked in there, and it's like, whoa, you know, you couldn't do any work in the greenhouse without being imposed upon by this uh, dross of Bernarda, you know. And it wasn't even the bloody giant, you know, it was just this, the standard southeast form that was growing massive, you know. And as I said, you know, I think that's what it is, our hobby. Everyone wants to grow big, fast, colourful plants. And um, some of these commercial places and, and maybe some of the old timers, I don't know, are, are playing silly buggers, you know. They've, it's almost, you see some of the European videos, and they've all got, almost got this sub-smug look on their face, you know. They almost know that they're, well, basically they're lying to you. They're telling you, to, this is what we do, this is what they do. And you know by the look on their faces, they're not doing what they're saying you're supposed to do. They're doing something completely different. That's how they're getting nice-looking plants. But, you know, if people actually talk to one another, you know, we might actually be able to grow them better than all that. You know, so everyone can grow... Not just decent plants that you're seeing at the moment, but you, you know. <laughs> yeah, get to the wild stage and go beyond. Oh, here we go. Well, this is an interesting trail. Might just follow this one down, see where it goes. <laughs> As you do. <laughs> but, uh, oh. Yeah, it's a bad year, fellas. But you can see the moisture there. Oh, maybe I need to go to Spot Current for you, fellas, yeah. 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 This is only 1080p. I reckon 4K will you'll get to see what I get to see, I suppose. But uh, I still see a much wider span of field than the camera can pick up. So even though it's a landscape camera, <laughs> it still doesn't capture what you know. Um... Oh, it's better though. Oh. Better than the King John Howard years when we had fuck all. We still basically have got fuck all broadband in this country. And the way it's going, you know. <sighs> I, think, I think that's what Aussies are doing. We're just putting solar on our roof, saying, oh, fuck you. We're just going to do it ourselves. And we're just not go we're not going to go to the fibre, uh, to the nodes sort or of thing. We're just saying, no way, mate. We're just going to let it collapse until you're going to have to do the, 